Fish fans, it's Raina. I'm living my best Carol Baskin life right now. I'm trying to transition to like a cool blonde, but it's gonna take a number of sessions. I think I've had three or four so far. So I, I wanna do the Lady Gaga hair and it's just gonna take me a little bit, all right? Got my flower crown, so just bear with me while I'm in between stuff. I got my little guy River with me. He just turned a year old. Can you believe it? I can't. It, it blew, it flew by, it blew by. It's crazy, isn't it, buddy? River's gonna help me with the Mern Taylor unboxing, aren't you? Yeah, let's let's get to it. So I haven't really told anybody what I've got here, but I will say that I sold off a number of skins in order to afford this one. Uh, basically because I, I looked at my inventory and was like, what am I not using? And I didn't really have a super fancy tail. A lot of people on my team, especially Merman Equinox, they have really fancy tails for specific occasions. I'm booking way less parties because I personally don't wanna do parties right now. My team are doing them because I have River. I'm only doing uh, events that are kind of like really, really big events. And I need something. Yeah, buddy. I need something that is like fancy. River has started trying to walk. Mommy's trying not to cut the bag. Don't fall, bud. Motherhood, this is like my whole life is trying to keep my kid from dying. <laughs> Do you want to stand? Here, there we go. There, that's all he wants. This is motherhood, guys. This is what it's like. It's trying to do an unboxing video while your kid screams at you. Okay, are you ready for this? I didn't tell anybody I was getting this. I'm super excited. And again, I don't just blow money on tails all the time. I sold off several skins that I haven't been using so I could afford this. Thank you to the mermaids who bought them. Woo! There's a meme in here. It says, very nice. It's a Borat. <laughs> okay, this is a Mer Taylor X. Extended fin, my first one. It's for the Fantasy Free. This started out as a modification that another mermaid got. I don't know her real name, but her handle on everything is Snowdropolis, I think. I think that's her. Anyway, she ordered this and people loved it so much that Mer Taylor decided to put it into production. So kudos to her for coming up with the mod. This is so freaking beautiful. I'm gonna have to look it up to tell you what the actual name is. Look at these extra fins. It's my first extended fin. And I believe it has a longer zipper. All the tails now coming with a longer zipper to make it easier for monofin insertion. Check it out, Riv. Look at that giant fin. I haven't really had any of the extended tails speak to me the way this one did. I, I tried Merman Equinoxes, but I like this one. It's more my colors, I think. It goes with all my wigs. I have a top coming from the Lemonade Mermaid that's gonna fit it. Look at that dorsal. River's excited about it. Double dorsal split, pelvic fins, side fins, knee fins. A big fluke. I've got these two necklaces that are gonna go well with it. Got these in Digby. From Atlantic Treasures. So I've got that. So let me show you my Mer Taylor hack I came up with in combination with Mermaid Nova. I said we need an insert for when we're doing dry land photo shoots or dry land gigs because wearing the monofin, the heavy monofin, it's more likely to get damaged on dry land from trying to lift it around and drag it. And then you get dragging. Yes, you get dragging on the skin. So I said, what if we could make an insert to just, you know, not for swimming, but just to make it easier to do dry land stuff. And Nova and I came up with this. This is a first iteration. It's a foam fluke made and shaped to the three with some little sandal style pockets. Hers have actual foot pockets, but I wasn't able to, to be there for her to form them to my feet. So this is our hack, our cheat for dry land stuff. So I might try and see if I can put it in so that I can show you what the fluke looks like totally. So we've got the longer zipper here, which really, that makes a huge difference. That's right. He's, he's getting ready to be a vlogger, man. He's, he's getting there. 
I haven't used this yet because I lent mine to uh, Mermaid Tawala to use for a cake. So I haven't, this is my first time actually putting it in, so bear with me. I mean, it's foam. If it breaks, I'll just throw some duct tape on it. Okay, is that all the way in, almost? Thanks, River, for your help, buddy. What a good helper you are. Yes, you're helping. Oh my gosh. Best idea ever, making this zipper longer. And Sean, I was telling them that I can't remember the name of the tail. I'm the worst tail collector. I don't remember any of the names. I couldn't get this out of my head. So this is technically like a birthday present to myself. Birthday's in November, maybe 37. I love the foam, not having to care if you bend it, not like a regular monofin. I am gonna do a monofin insertion video. I get Sean to do all my monofins because trouble with my motor control and I'm always worried about braking. We also have a lot of reviews coming up. Just, we haven't had a lot of time to do all the stuff we wanted to because Sean rolled his ankle and then I, I've been filming with a TV show and we can't use that footage because they bought it. So a lot of our stuff we haven't been able to use because they bought it. So I mean the foot pockets are kind of obvious but it's really that's easy to edit out in photos. This isn't for swimming. It's not for wet photo shoots. It's just for those times you know when you just want to get some photos or do a dry gig without having a 25 pound monofin on your feet. So this gives you an idea of how big the extended fin is. Look at that, gorgeous. I cannot wait to do photos. So like I said, I have a top coming with it. Super gorgeous. Um, I don't know how well you can see it here, but there's just so much nice detail here. The green fins transition and they have gold tips and then they transition to gold and transition to yellow. And then those colors kind of bleed back out into the fluke. And I love that the fluke has gold tips. The green and gold is just really, really nice. It really goes well together. What do you think, Rivi? What do you think? Pretty nice, isn't it, bud? Mommy should have bought you a matching one, because that's my thing, matching tails with the baby all the time. <laughs> when mommy gets back to work, I will totally do that, because I like having all the options. Yeah. So yeah, I'm super excited to swim with this. Like I said, I've got some necklaces to go with it. I'm gonna do a photo shoot where I've got gills. I got these gills online. They're from that company, FX Transfers. The website is uh, tinsleytransfers.com if you're looking for a pair. Now they're not waterproof because they use water to stick on. They're safe and non-toxic and I got them so that I could put a pair on river as well for some photos. So if you want them to be skin safe for a baby, they need to be this type. Otherwise you can find ones that'll stay on underwater and need like glue. This just sticks on with water. But it's gonna be pretty cool, I think. I'm pretty excited. And yeah, I'm gonna go out, today is Wednesday. I'm gonna go out on Friday. It's raining today, but I'm gonna go out on Friday to get some photos with this and to swim in it and try it out. And it's really, really gorgeous. Like I really cannot get over how gorgeous it is. It's got some creases in it from being folded in the, in the box. But after I leave it out for a little bit, it should be okay. The whimsy material is just so, nice because I've been using the guppies a lot lately and I have some that are guppy material like the fantasy skin material and then I have some that are whimsy so so thanks for checking me out I have a lot of other unboxing videos and I will get to testing this out and give you a review of what it's like with the extended fin I'm super excited please check us out on patreon.com slash mermaid you can follow me on Instagram Twitter and Facebook 
HFX Mermaid, and I also have a Facebook fan page, Raina and the Mermaid Sea Fans, that you can join where I just post so many cool behind the scenes stuff. And yeah, we just we really appreciate you. If you watch this video, I would really love if you could like toss me a comment or a like. It's hard for me to judge what kind of videos people are gonna like. So it just really helps if you do that. It gives me good feedback on like where I should be focusing my energy and my resources. And now that I'm a mother, let me tell you, I have so few of those things. So I need that feedback so I know like what's worth making and what should I not bother with. So do you like unboxing videos? Do you want more sneak peeks and unboxing videos? Do you want more reviews? Let me know what you think in the comments. Best fishes. What do you think, Riv? Look at this fluke. It is just gorgeous. No, honey, don't eat the battery. This is what parenting is like 90% of the time. Don't eat the battery. Don't eat it. Don't eat it. You good? Don't eat it, okay? No. You gonna help me with the package? Are you excited? Here, we'll try this again. We're gonna, I'm gonna start again. 